being in that space between sea and land is always where I felt the most grounded. I feel like all my stresses and everything just disappears. It's just a beautiful space where there's a lot of excitement and energy and humor. A lot of aquariums that you go to, you'll wander through and it's gorgeous and it's quiet or maybe there's some background music and you see things, but they're a little bit set away. And in here, instead of being a living art gallery, we're more of a hands-on artist studio. It's salty and it's loud and you get your hands in tanks and you can feel the difference between the smooth skin of a sea cucumber versus the rough shell of a channel top snail. Our hope is, is that you will connect with these animals and realize that they are freely interesting living beings worthy of care and respect. That they have independent lives that we need to respect and be careful with. The collect and release process is actually a lot more complicated than a lot of people might know. What I really love about it is that it's part of us connecting back to how we care for the world. It's, I think, easy to fall in love with an organism when it's in here, and then we can be completely in control of its world, and we can care for it and make sure that it's safe. But when we put it back into the wild, we have to recognize that we no longer have full control over it, so we have to care for the whole ecosystem. So if I know that there is something that I absolutely love that is there in that harbor. I have to protect the whole harbor. And that's recognizing that we're all connected to this space and everything that we do impacts it. I think that Ukulit is such a great location for this facility because we have such a history with commercial fishing and recreational fishing. I think it's so important for us to take a moment to recognize that there's more than salmon and halibut and lingcod in our waters. When we are very extraction and industry focused, we lose sight of that complexity, but it's the complexity that supports the full system. And so a place like ours can help to integrate people back into that complexity. And then we can work to make sure that the ecosystem stay healthy so that we continue to recreate and have fun and fish and do all the things we love doing.